The Liverpool striker Robbie Fowler has apologised for his controversial goal celebrations in the Merseyside derby. He said the stress of false drug allegations had got to him. There was little doubting what Fowler was doing in his misguided goal celebrations yesterday and from the wording of his unequivocal apology, there's little doubt Liverpool have taken a dim view of his antics. In his statement issued by the club, Fowler says sorry to fans, his teammates and his manager. Despite my actions being taken in the heat of the moment immediately following the penalty, I realise that they have caused great offence and I deeply regret that. Fowler makes no excuse for his behaviour, although he claims he has been the target of drug-taking slurs from Everton fans in the past, notably during the Merseyside derby at Goodison in October. He says those allegations have been upsetting to his family, but accepts he should let his football silence the terrorist critics. I have responsibilities and a duty to rise above such scurrilous accusations, and I accept my behaviour was totally wrong. His manager tried to defuse the row after yesterday's match. Any goal as this kind of ceremonial, you know, sometimes they do other things, they dance uh, uh, near the uh, corner flag and they do things. But in France, um, that, the Rigobert songs were very known, you know, to eat the grass and sniff the grass and yeah. go that. It wasn't convincing, and the speed with which Liverpool have begun the damage limitation demonstrates the club's concern. But the apology is unlikely to be enough to save the England forward from censure from the FA. To react in that way. Um, I think he's, he's very, very silly from Robbie's point of view and I'm sure it's going to land him in more trouble now. The incident couldn't have come at a worse time for Fowler, who will face an FA disciplinary hearing this week for his much-criticised clash with Chelsea's Graham Lasso. Laurie Tucker, Sky News.